everybody, welcome back to A Glittery Life. I'm so glad you're tuning in today. I'm really excited about this video. I have been wanting to do this video for a while, actually probably since I started a channel, but it wasn't the right season. So today's video is my fall fashion favorites, my fall fashion must-haves, um, but basically what it is, is the things that I cannot wait to wear. And I'm just like crossing my fingers and like saying a prayer that LA gets a fall, because if not, I'm gonna be hot and dressing inappropriately because I'm still gonna wear fall clothes because I can't wait. So in addition to this being a really cool video that I'm excited about, I'm also doing this video as a collab with Leslie from, her channel is called Lip Gloss Leslie and she's so awesome. She uploads videos like crazy, she's super great, she does all these amazing tutorials and she knows how to like rock a wet and wild eyeshadow like it's a like Dior shadow. I mean it's unreal. She's so good at it. So if you use a lot of drugstore brands and you haven't subscribed to her channel, you need to. But even if you don't, you need to subscribe to her channel because she's just really cool. We've become friends over social media and I'm, I love it because I just think she's such a rad gal. So I'll link her channel down below and you're gonna, check her, gonna have to check her out and watch her video too. So what are my fall favorites? Like what are my fall must haves? Like I'm so excited. First off, I'm not even sure if LA is gonna get a fall. Some people say that they get like two weeks of a fall. That's not long enough for me. So I am like crossing my fingers and I'm like saying a little prayer that it turns cold and that I get to start wearing all the clothes that I wanna wear. Otherwise, I'm gonna be dressed seasonally inappropriate and I don't know what to do. Like, I'm just gonna have to do it. And I, I'm gonna have to like reapply my deodorant all day long because I'll be so hot because I'm gonna be wearing scarves and beanies and boots and jackets and I mean, so if you live in LA and you bump into me and I look like I live in Idaho, I know, I know, I don't know what to do other than I love fall and I love fall fashion. So, okay, what are my fall favorites? Let's start with, actually, let's start with what I have on. Okay, starting with what I have on, I wanna show this awesome military jacket. I think it's super cute. It's got really amazing studs on it. It's like got a really cool detail. Like this is, I just love it. And it's sort of like a tailored like fit too. So it's a little bit of a cross between like a motorcycle jacket. It's got like the quilting on the shoulders. Anything quilted right now is so hot for fall. And obviously studs are still mega in for fall, thank God, because I love them. So I wanna show this jacket. And so if you can find yourself like a really cool like moto military like studded combo jacket like thumbs up that's super in for fall and really I'm really excited about it the other thing is this color oxblood now some of you know this color as burgundy or maroon that's what I grew up with this color being but now it's oxblood so anyway if you can get your hands on something this color it's a great fall color it looks beautiful with navy it looks great with browns it looks great with black it obviously looks great with this military green and you just can't go wrong so and it's also a really good color for a lot of different skin types and or skin tones what other clothes am i loving for fall right now i have to show you these leggings i'm like dying over them so they're just like black leggings but they are like studded all the way down on both sides now, and it looks like they're like glitter studs, but they're not. They're just kind of reflecting the light because they're like just black on black like studs. Um, I'll put a picture in. I wore these to an event that um, Gretchen from The Daily Cupcake and I went to. So I'll, if I can learn how to split screen that, I'll, I'll put a picture of me rocking these leggings because I love them. So leggings, thank God, are back. But I think it's always a really good idea to wear something long enough that covers your like butt and your crotch if you're gonna wear leggings because there's some wardrobe malfunctions that happen I see frequently women having some wardrobe malfunctions because their shirt doesn't cover anything or hits like their midriff or whatever and they're wearing leggings and sometimes you just see a little too much of the person and um, nobody wants that so if you're gonna rock leggings rock them responsibly okay what else am I excited about for this fall well, I can't wait to wear beanies. I love beanies. This is a really cool slouchy beanie um, that I just picked up and I love it that it's got like these blue and white like chevron type stripes. And it's just gonna be so fun for fall if it ever gets cold enough just to wear this beanie. Now I'll probably have to do like a side swept bang because this bang is a little bit cousin it. It's a little intense to have like this powerful or like this bold of a bang with a beanie on. Look at now you just can't even see it's so cousin it. <laughs> but anyway, irregardless of my bangs, I'm really excited to wear beanies and the slouchy kind, not the like tight ski beanies. Like save those for the slopes, people. Save those for the slopes. 
Okay, I have a couple scarves that I'm really excited about because I'm loving all these florals that are out right now. So like this is the pattern of this scarf. It's this amazing floral and it's actually a circle scarf, which is even better. It's like one of those infinity, like to infinity and beyond, like infinity circle scarves. I love it. Oh, isn't that so pretty? Just warms up your face, like, and just this like pretty pattern. It's like a little bit, looks like a little bit of a Monet painting. And um, these kind of muted colors, not the bright spring colors, but anyway, really excited to be wearing this scarf in the fall. I want you to know right now, I can't turn my air conditioning on when I film videos because it's too noisy. It's like 100 degrees. It feels so hot in here with this jacket and now this scarf on. So anyway, this circle scarves are back, thank God. And look for one in a really cool, bold, like, floral pattern for this fall. See if I can get it out. Okay. What else? I have one more scarf to show you before I move on. I have this like amazing like aztec -y, like I guess that's like, at, yeah, like Aztec, like Nate, almost like maybe print and I love it and it's huge and it is like, I don't know if it'll ever get cold enough here in LA to wear this scarf, but let me tell you, I love this one so much. Ooh, I just want to like snuggle up with this and this might be my like, well, I wore it last season and where I lived it was cold enough, but oh, I can't wait to wear this. I love it so much. The other thing I love about this scarf is it's one of those big, it's like so big and so wide and so long that it makes like a beautiful wrap. Like just so nice. Oh, fall. I love you. Okay. All the fashion reports that I'm reading right now are say that hair flare is trending for fall. So I picked up a hair flare that was perfect for my personality. A little black studded bow headband. I love bows. I love anything with bows. And y'all know I love myself a good stud. So, <laughs> sorry to say that. It's hard to say that and keep a straight face. But anyway, how cute is this? I can't wait to wear this. I wore this to BeautyCon. I had my hair up in a big top knot and I wore this cute little um, headband because I knew at BeautyCon I would be hugging everybody and the back of my hair by the end of the day would have been in dreadlocks. So, but I can't wait to wear this this fall and um, find, your, find yourself a good piece of hair flare. That's all I've got to say. Okay, statement necklaces. Thank God the statement necklaces are still in style. However, for the fall, you need to leave those big, chunky, fluorescent pieces behind. Pull those out again around Easter, Valentine's Day, if you're trying to beat the winter blahs, but you need to find something different for fall and winter. I've got a couple suggestions. One of them being this incredible statement necklace right here, this big, chunky gold chain. It's got a beautiful stone, like smoky, like, to like quartz stone. It's got some emeralds, it's got some diamonds on it, and it is so awesome. And it's a little bit like, kind of like heavy, but chic at the same time. I actually wore this this week with a black cocktail dress to a red carpet event. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, uh, Trisha Lee underscore W, you can see this necklace in action. In fact, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you might as well. It's I post really interesting things about my life in LA. And uh, if you're not a baseball fan, now that the Dodger, now that like baseball season's almost over, you'll you won't see me posting a picture of myself at Dodger Stadium every week because that's kind of what I do. So anyway, this is a great statement necklace, really fun. And then and I have one more statement necklace to show you that I'm like so jazzed about. Look at this baby, it's like Freebird. I love this, like so cool. I wore this to an event. Um, I think actually I wore this to the same event that I wore those studded leggings to. So um, you'll have seen that already. But how cool is this crazy necklace? This like gemmed out eagle on this like dirty gold bronze chain. So statement necklaces, they're gonna take on a little bit more of a like harder like feel, a little bit less like of the bubblegum statement necklaces that we've been having so much fun with um, all spring and summer. So be looking for a little more rocker chic to add to your uh, jewelry this fall. Okay, what else? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's talk handbags because I'm saving the best for last. Shoes. Um, I wish I could cue like little angels singing right now, but I don't have like a recording of that. Okay, let's talk about bags. So I'm really excited. I've got two bags for this fall that I cannot wait to use. Actually, one of them I'm using already. One of them though 
this is like my going this is like my my fall like going out bag it is this like amazing it's not very big which is perfect for going out oops it still has like the little thing on it fringe bag look at that like leather fringe dancing with this like bright gold yeah, like yellow gold chain super pumped about this the other thing is you can detach the chain and you can carry it as a clutch which is kind of sexy I'm not gonna lie so can't wait to be rocking this all fall and the other one that I've been using from like my everyday bag is this like oxblood messenger bag this and it's not quite big like a messenger bag it's like more like purse size but this is so cute it's like leather and then it's like suede so it's like suede like ox blood and it has the cutest little detailing for how you like open it up I love this little like hook deal it's like full of my stuff right now so I'm trying to be careful not to spill it but such a cute bag love that okay we're almost done with my favorites for fall but I've got three must-have shoe items for this fall one of them are a pair of studded cheetah print loafers so these are those cute like little like driving slipper loafers that um are everywhere right now these are actually made by ugg so that they they are like everything that to wear them they are so amazing they're so soft and um who knew ugg was being so chic but they're so cute they've got the little studs all over them this little i said cheetah but i meant leopard i'm i don't know my animals very well um obviously i totally meant leopard print i um i Okay, so I'm in my late 30s, right? So I have to be careful with the animal prints. I can use animal prints to accessorize, but I, as much as I love a pair of crazy leggings and wear crazy leggings, I gotta stay away from like the cheetah print, or I keep saying that. I gotta stay away from like the leopard print leggings or like a leopard print dress. Like if you're in your early 20s or you're, if you're in high school still, you could be head to toe leopard and still get away with it. At my age, You've got to accessorize. You've got to like swagger responsibly. So these are my attempt to swagger responsibly with the leopard print. And I love once again that they have got these cute little beaded studs on them. So perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. My other shoe obsession right now are these little booties, these suede booties. They are kind of like a gray, like taupey gray. And how cute are these? They are super cute with like skinny jeans. They're really cute with a skirt or a dress. And they're like epic with um, leggings. Oh, I love them. I've been like loving wearing these even though it's been so hot. And last but not least, my fall must have is another boot. Now I am a boot curator. I have been collecting boots for years and years and years. My boot collection rivals the crown jewel collection that's housed at the Tower of London. And I mean, it's that epic, really, truly that epic. If you follow me on Instagram, once again, if this is a, I guess this is a plug for my Instagram. Follow me on Instagram, homies. Um, you'll get to see my boot collection um, as it's unveiled this fall. But I am just obsessed with these boots. Look at how these are so major. Look at these. Um, God, they just smell. They are like, they're the heavy duty, thick, hard leather, all leather, like stiff, like cowboy boot, but they're not a cowboy boot. It's more of a riding boot. I love the detailing. I love the leather straps with the buckles. I love this rope, the braided rope that's around them. They zip up the back and they are like the sexiest tough boot I have ever seen. And I am dying to wear these. Fortunately, LA Fashion Week is coming up and I've got some fun events and I'm going to work these in where, when and wherever possible. So anyway, y'all thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to go watch Lip Gloss Leslie's Fall Favorites and I hope that you found something on here that you like. Now, if you're like, she didn't tell us where any of this stuff was from, you know what? You can find out where every single piece that I just showed you is from. www.aglitterylife.com will, will have this video and then a list of where every single item and exactly where it's from so you know how to find it. So head on over to my website to check that out and leave me a comment on this video to tell me what your favorite fall pieces are and what you loved that I just showed you today. Thanks so much. Have a great day.